Hi guys, welcome to my channel today. It's your girl here, Love in the City. I'm behind the scenes today, and I'm going to be sharing with you a small jewelry haul that I got from Amazon and eBay. But first, I would like to say hello to my new subscribers, and hello to my day ones. I hope everyone is having a nice day or evening or whenever you are watching this. So let's just jump right into this jewelry, okay guys? It's not a whole lot, but it's pretty. And I decided that I would like to share it with you all. Now, this is a pair of earrings that I got from Amazon. Now, the description says black. I'm not even sure if you can see the black, but maybe if I hold it like that, it has black in uh, in the enamel part around where I guess where the diamonds are. Now it's not as black as I would have liked it to be, or from what I saw on the advisement uh, on Amazon. I'm not sure the name of the seller. Um, but I will research that for you and I'll make sure I put it in the description box below but they are really pretty I'm not even sure if my Canon camera is picking up the bling but it's it's blinging for the gods I'm telling you it's got some serious bling now mind you I already have two pairs and I'm not sure if they're from the same seller but um, I have a silver which is just like all diamond it looks like all diamond and um I have a pair of gold and it has the gold but it has the white faux diamond in it these are not sterling silver but the bling on it the brilliance is just amazing okay so I'm gonna move these to the side because we don't want to talk about those earrings all day I could in fact let me just jump right in because it's right here on my counter this is the silver pair that I was mentioning. I've been thinking about wearing these and I just happened to take them out. But yeah, that's the silver pair. So I guess, let's see if I can hold them both up. You can see the black, the difference in it a little. Okay, moving on. Next in this box, I actually had the, the company's name on it. I pulled it off. Cause I plan to repurpose this box, put something pretty on top, maybe bling it out because the box is nice and sturdy and I have a lot of black in my beauty area. So let's see the top off that and this they have inside, I don't know the seller either. Um, they have a, a dust bag in it and so as soon as I'm done filming this with you guys, I will put it in there and then place it back into the box. But this is a, a what you call it, I guess like a snowflake that's what I call it I forget what the name of the description says I think it did say snowflake but these are really light they're dainty maybe two inches and then let me see if I can turn in the back it's just a flat surface so you won't have anything scratching up against you but I thought that was really cute and pretty so when the holidays come around I'll probably be just put these on and rock it out. Alrighty. And next we have Everfaith. Now that is the name of the company. I have several pieces of jewelry for them, from them. And I plan to repurpose these boxes too. I'm just going to keep it. And put on. Uh, well this I'll keep what's in it. But maybe I'll decorate it. On top. And uh, we'll start with this little one here. I'll just stand here. Okay, that's Everfaith again, and that is from Amazon. Look at this pretty, it has a Tiffany look. I guess that's why I like it so much. Uh, there's another velvet dust bag. They even give you spare diamonds if one comes out. And I am a, a, a skull rock and roll lover. Nothing demonic about me liking skulls and diamonds, but... um. You know, I do like the rock and roll vibe, the feel. Not even sure if the camera is picking that up. Sometimes if you move too fast in front of the cannon, it gets blurred. But um, it has diamonds all inside in the front. 
now this is flat here where the hand and the feet are and the head of course and part of um but it's just all it's all blinked out and this is a brooch pin so you know if you have your little jacket on or whatever i'll be placing it there there and uh who knows i could be placing it on a collar whatever but i have a necklace that i'm going to show you that all coincides with the skull jewelry i thought that was so stinking cute and it's just blinged out okay gives it a more glam feel versus something that looks demonic or whatever but you know i have like skull t-shirts i could rock it out with you know winter time come you could put on your little rock and roll shirt throw your jewelry on and your boots your handbag boom you're out the door all right here's Ever faith and they have this uh, foam inside for a little air protection. Here is another dust bag. It's nice and big and pretty and soft. And here's the piece de resistance inside. Okay. Hold your horses for what I'm about to show you. Because this is how I do it. And then you got the extra little pad in there. Boom. I'm not even sure if I said before, like I said before, if that camera is picking up the brilliance on this. Let me see. Maybe I got a light on my camera. Okay. I turned the light on that I have attached to my camera. I should have done that from the beginning. It looks a little brighter now. You can actually see what's going on. Get your lives. Okay, ladies or gents, whoever is watching. But uh, yeah, this is a headband. And this headband, even though you see all that bling on it, you think I paid a lot of money for it. I did not. This this only cost twenty five dollars. I'm just saying, only twenty five dollars. And so you know you can wear it up, which is what, what I may do, or you can wear it that way, like a princess. But you know I'll probably wear it on top. I don't even know how I'm gonna wear it. I just know it's pretty, and I wanted to share it with you guys. And as you saw before. I put the top on the thing now. Let's see if what it looks like side by side. Uh oh, it's stuck. And then you have your pendant, which is skull as well. All righty. Look at that. Just let you drink that in for a second. Boom. I think I'll leave it sitting out just so I can show you a comparison with the last piece that I'm going to share with you guys. And then that will be the end of this little haul. Okay. Now this came from eBay. And uh, I don't know the personal seller right off. But that's the name of uh, what the jewelry is. So I'm pretty sure if you type that in. It comes up because they have other jewelry as well. But as I said before we get other. I'll look it up to see. If I can get that information for you. Let's sit this top to the side. Okay. Look at the bling up in here. I'm going to just tilt it. I'm going to take it out and show you. But look at that. What? I, I don't know if it's going to be. It's probably going to be too much if I wear all that together, you know. Unless I'm going to a costume party, but I don't think I am. So, I don't. I probably won't be wearing these two clothes together because that's more white diamond. This is a little more grayish black color. So, but I just wanted to show you two. Show you the two together. Okay. Now. This right here is going to set you back a little bit. I'm going to just hold it there. But I'm going to put it on my uh, mannequin. Uh, what do you call it? My uh, display thing right here that you see. This this right here. I'm going to put it on there. I actually got that from a thrift store. I got them both and I haven't <laughs> shared it with you. I'm so sorry. I've been doing other things with my life. But yeah, look at this. Y'all don't, don't even realize how much bling this is. 
I know this camera is not picking up the bling. And here's the skull. So I, I may wear this skull and the other brooch together, the little brooch one, because this skull here has diamonds inside of the bone as well on the front of the arms. The back, you know, is all smooth. So nothing should be tugging. And look at that. Now this costs a hundred and $85. Yes, I said $185. So you know it, it is blinging for the gods. Okay? Yes, I spent that much on this. I don't, yeah, I don't even know. But if I see something pretty, I'm going to get it. I don't care. That is dope. That is so cool. It's a rock and roll. Okay, guys. I'm going to put this on the little display mannequin right there so you guys can fully see how it looks and then I'm going to say bye bye but right now let me get it on there and I'm going to show you okay okay guys I got it on the display thing here okay I think I paid I think I paid $12 for this I'm not sure but anyway it goes it's like it looks like a one of those uh, kimono dresses I'll just pan down just so you can see back up. Yeah, I got that from a thrift store out here where I live. And for those who are new, if you didn't know where I live, I'm in Atlanta, Georgia. Yeah, it's hot here too. Okay, check that out. Look at that. It is so, so pretty. And it has, not only does it uh, have skulls on it with, you know, all blinged out diamond, it has a crown. It has like the little crosses. That's like one of the what you I forget what you call that cross right there. It's like you know one of those European crosses. And then there's another cross and bling. And then the skull here, the skeleton, the skull here has green in the eyes. You know, like I guess green with envy. But um, it's really cute. And then you got other little crosses like this has a double cross. It's got bling on it here. Wait a minute, it's caught around. Sorry guys. Okay, now that's supposed to hang low, yeah. So you got your long little cross that hangs there. And then you got your crown with the cross on top. And then crown here. And this one here is a lion. And you know the lion, that's the lion. The lion is the king of the jungle, honey. And he has the crown on top of its head or, sh or her head. And then, um, well, it has to be a he because it's, it's the king. But um, it's got the green diamonds, a faux diamond, an emerald, whatever, in the eye and then another skull. And then it's just really pretty. To me, it is. In my opinion, it's really pretty. So, yeah, I will be wearing that with either some type of rockabilly dress or some type of rock and roll t-shirt or skull t-shirt or what have you. That's what I plan to wear. Wait, just, just rock it out. Or if I just want to do it for kicks and giggles, if I just have on all black or whatever and I just boom and I want that necklace to pop to be the statement, that's what your girl will do. And that's what I will do. And then, of course, here's the crown. Like I said, I don't think I'm going to wear the two together. But I didn't pull it out because I didn't want to overwhelm you. I guess I could have shared it with you guys. I, but I just couldn't remember if I have done a haul on it or not. That's the only reason why I didn't. But um, with this company here, Every Faith, um, they have, uh, I, well, I already have it. They have earrings, too, that are skull drop earrings. And it goes perfect with this necklace. So I have, you know, and it has the fish hook. It's not a post. Uh, so I have the fish hook earrings that dangle down, or should I say dangle earrings, and it has a skull on it. It has like a skull like that. And then I think it has a cross on it. I'm not sure. It has something dangling down on it. And I have that. And I also, from this company, I have the diamond, uh, which is this color. I think they called it either black or gray, but it it's the same type of bling color and uh, it's skull too. I have the bracelet. So yeah, I got it all blinged out. I'm sorry I didn't pull that out to share with you guys. But I hope you like this video anyway and give your girls a thumb up. And uh, I know I've been talking, but you know I haven't been on here in a minute. So hopefully you guys don't mind. And uh, yeah, just, you know, send me a message if you love it. Let me know if you like it or you don't like it. And you know... 
Okay, I guess I could take those too, but everybody don't like everything. All right, so I'm going to bid you guys a farewell, and I hope to see you again soon. And thanks for watching. Bye, guys.